Smash that like button if you woke up this morning. Let's get the day started and do not forget to subscribe below. Okay, so we got Mike Tyson, we got WAC 100, we got 50 Cent, we got Drake, we got Joel Santana, we got uh, Frank Lucas. Uh, we just got a lot of stuff going on, okay? A uh, little Dirk. I'm gonna give you guys just a, a rough update on everything and then we'll get into more detailed videos later. Uh, this is Jordan Tower with JT News. Please hit that like button. I love you guys so much and I hope you're having a great day. It's Friday. You got the weekend coming up. You're gonna get through today. Positive vibes. I appreciate you guys so much and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell. I appreciate you. Okay, and don't forget to subscribe. Okay, so Drake is selling. I don't know if you saw the game last night, the first game where the Raptors took the Warriors in the first game. Uh, Drake is selling the lint he took from Steph Curry's head on eBay, and it's now selling for $96,000. Now, obviously, these have been proven to just be run up. The, the, they run up the, uh, the bids. And then the, the final buyer is, is just like for publicity. Nobody's paying that much money for that, uh, but it's funny. We got uh, Rotimi. He owed 50 cent $300,000. Uh, Rotimi revealed that it was because of the label contract they signed back in 2014. 50 cent graciously let him out, but he said there's still business at hand. Rotimi agreed to pay. The amount of money over time out of, off of royalties that's what 50 cent was referring to rotimi gave him a hundred thousand dollar advance on that uh and to, before the money comes in, in a couple months from his number one album and 50 cent quickly ran to the jeweler and spent that on a watch <laughs> okay then we got uh, a lot of people are reporting that mike tyson and whack 100 was a, a stunt pulled to bring attention to Mike Tyson's podcast, are we surprised? Absolutely not. Trolling uh, has made people's careers like a 6 9 or uh, a lot of other people. They just troll, 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 and then, you know, they get famous. So uh, this was probably a business rollout. WAC 100, they pretended a fight happened. WAC 100 played it out. Mike Tyson played into it as well. And yes, I am watching the podcast now, so I guess it worked, right? <laughs> I guess the trolling worked because I'm watching. I really enjoy the Mike Tyson podcast so far because uh, it's more of a conversation, kind of like a Joe Rogan. And it's Mike Tyson, man. Mike Tyson's character and his uh, his character is just amazing, you know, uh, especially today how he matured. Then we got Drake also to continuing to troll in the finals, uh, having a slight beef with the Warriors team as, it, you know, I guess they're playing it. I mean, it's bringing fun to basketball. Then we got Little Dirk. Uh, we know that he has surrendered. I reported that last night. Um, his mugshot was released and we can get into his charges. It is a criminal attempt to commit murder, aggravated assault, shooting at, unlawful for a person employed by, associated with criminal street gang to conduct, participate in crime. Possession of a firearm during commission of a felony, possession of a firearm a convicted felon. Now, the guy that's the victim that they, that survived, He's in jail in Chicago for shooting up a club. So this is also... Look at what they labeled his hair, though. Blonder strawberry. <laughs> they don't know what it is in Atlanta, you know. His real name is Banks. D Dirk Banks. Okay. 5'10", 150. Skinny. Super skinny. Um, it's not like they really weigh you, though. Uh, okay, so then... Uh, Frank Lucas possibly has passed. Uh, he was the guy that Denzel Washington played. Uh, he, Denzel Washington played his life on American Gangster, the movie. I'm sure most of you have seen it. And, uh, you know, he he just took over the, the drug game in New York back in, what was it, the 70s or something? I don't know. I don't know. But uh, definitely uh and then he turned in a lot of cops when he got arrested and got time service time off crooked cops um that's controversial anyways he might have passed 
Uh, then we got an RIP to him. Offset won't be charged in felony phone smashing case. Pays to repair screen. Finally, he does the right thing. <laughs> uh, someone put out a PSA. Do not borrow money from 50 Cent anymore. <laughs> Obviously, when you owe him... He puts you on blast. And then it's finally Joelle Santana. Wife can Bella reveal she drives to Virginia bi-weekly to visit him. Um, I guess he gets out in, what, two more years or something like that. And he has a baby on the way. So that's the catching up with the news. This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you hit that bell, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. I love you guys so much. And make sure you go to Experian. Make sure you go to Equifax and TransUnion.com to dispute things on your credit because when you get things off your credit, your credit score goes up and you're more or less of a risk to lenders. I'll check you guys later. Peace.